Hey guys, welcome to Easy Peasy Redstone, a tutorial series where I push this button. <laughs> oh, oh my god, holy crap, what the hell's... Oh, oh my god, oh my god, why, why is this happening? Oh, oh my god, I'm so scared, oh my, no, I want my mommy! <laughs> Alright, I've removed the carcasses so we could do this tutorial. All the, the carcasses, the carkai, if you will, are gone. Uh, car guys, it's not really a word. Anyway, um, in the spirit of the two wide hidden stairs that I did recently, I want to show you guys an easy peasy version of the two wide hidden stairs. Now, mind you, this version is limited, and the reason I say that is because it requires a hallway in order for you to hide all the circuitry. But if you have a hallway, why not make this version? I I've actually used this version myself, so you know. Here you go. All right, so in order to start off, we're going to place two pistons facing upward like this. Block on each side. Redstone dust on each side of that. Block on each side of that. OK? Now, repeaters going into this block and that block, both of them set to 2. Now, what we're going to do is run some wire like this. And on top of these blocks right here on the end, torches. And now, blocks on top of those torches and as I called it as I called it before a torch sandwich <laughs> okay um, so make your torch sandwiches on each end and now off of these blocks you want to go three spaces out this way one two three and same thing over here one two three and run redstone dust right along the top like so okay now um, place pistons like this and like that and then give these pistons their blocks, like so. Come down here, place some stairs, and then on the same level of those, place another set of stairs, and then right down here, two more stairs, like that. Last but not least, the hallway that's going to hide this sucker. Dun dun dun, dun 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 Ta-da! Hidden stairs. Ha ha ha! Right on. And it was easy peasy. Redstone geeky. All right. Um, up next, I'm gonna show you guys a couple ways that you could uh, power this. So I'll be right back. All right. So now let me show you a few ways that you could power your stairs. Um, there's many many ways out there, and I'll just leave it up to you to do research and figure out which ones you like. However, for the sake of giving you a complete system, I will show you a few examples. So, uh, the first obvious one is is just, you know, stairs. That's it. You're done. Stairs. <laughs> very, very, uh, very newbie. <laughs> there you go. But, I mean, if you're doing this for looks, there you go. You're all set. Uh, however, you can't close it behind you, for example. If you want to get a little fancy, we can we can do something about that. Now, depending on what you're going to use, you're going to build the appropriate uh, circuit. If you're using levers, use an XOR gate. Build an XOR gate. All right. Let me show you one. That, uh, again, many others out there. But this is one that I like. Okay. Piston block. Uh, block here, block there, and torch here, torch there, two repeaters side by side like that, and your output will be along these blocks. Oh, that's not good. I need to move it back. Sorry, 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 sorry. Let's move it back a little bit. Okay. Now you can see me build it again. Bump, bump. Okay. There we go. Sorry about that. As I was saying, your your output will be along these these two blocks right here, okay? And so let's hook it up. And your input, your first input will be here, second input will be there. So let's hook these up to the levers. And do, 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 and now and what the hell? <laughs> That's wrong. <laughs> it didn't move and I wondered why don't worry about that. I wondered why uh it wasn't doing anything. All right, there we go. Okay. So 
Uh, let's let's fix that. There we go. Anyway, so no matter no matter what side you're on, you're gonna be able to close or open your stairs. Whoops. And eh, so that f oh, I knew it. That flicker. That that screwed it up. That's the only thing I hate about levers is you could accidentally spam them too fast. All right. So there you go. Uh, and even if you close it behind you and someone follows, doesn't matter. You can con you can control it from either side. Now, if you're going to use buttons, okay, you're going to want to use a T flip flop. Now let me show you the one that is most commonly used, or at least I feel is more commonly used. This one right here. Okay, nope, right there. Give it a block. Output's going to be right here and two blocks above like this redstone dust along the top torch torch your input's gonna be right there one input okay so they both share it now whenever you press the button it didn't reach did it <laughs> it didn't reach there you go and just in case who cares all right now, whenever you push the button, it'll open up. There you go. Again, there's many other T flip flops that you could use. You choose the one that you like the best. There's ones that are actually faster than this, where as, you, as soon as you press the button, it'll open up, instead of waiting for it to turn off the pulse. Anyway, um, now the last thing, okay, hidden switch. Uh, there, there are bud switches out there that you could use, or, or, or you could use this one that I, that I came up with. Um, I don't know if it's a new thing or not. I doubt it. I doubt it's anything. I'm sure somebody's discovered this already. But, uh, whoops. Place a piston, block, and then right where the piston of the block is going to come out, put a torch, and here is your output right here, and place a repeater set to at least, I want to say two, let's try two. Uh, and what that's going to do is when you place, this is going to be your key, okay, all right, you don't need that anymore. So now it's going to, your switch is completely hidden, and what you're going to do is place a torch right on the ground like that. Oh, and it worked. So yeah, two is good. If you have any problems, delay it a little more. And once you take it off, no big deal. So that way, when you take it off, you can take it with you, and nobody will know that anything was there. So there you go. There, there's one one way of doing a hidden switch. There's many others. Again, look them up. Uh, and but anyways, there you go. Here's your options that I present to you so far. So go build your stairs. Good luck with your stairs. And then the stairs and the stairs. Oh yeah, stair stairs. Drops are falling on my head. But that doesn't mean these cows are really dead. And wow, ocelots they land. I didn't know that, and they land in something and blah blah. <laughs> I didn't know ocelots landed.